Anyways, so that's that. I ate my food out of my baggie and I'm, I'm here. <laughs> So I'm just getting ready for the gym and I'm going to do the booty class with Stacey Alexander tonight. I just wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing. Muscle Club tank. Um, you can't really tell they're like, like snakeskin um, pants from Marshalls, my Nikes. And I'm off for a booty class. It's probably going to kick my booty, um, but I'm excited to be working with Stacy, And I got a few packages. I got my new roller that I ordered from um, M8, M80. I think it's what he's called. And then I also got my swimsuit top from Beach Babe Swimwear. It looks kind of big. We'll see, I'm gonna try it. And I got my Nakes, which look a little small, so I'm gonna try those. Not really uh, doing well with the ordering online situation. <laughs> we'll see, but anyways. I will talk to you guys a little bit later. I'll see if I can't film a little bit of it. All right, bye. Hey guys, so I obviously didn't film the workout. Um, I swear every time I do a booty class with Stacy, I often wonder if I have any muscle in my butt because I feel like we do it and I can't even, I can't even make it through. It's just she always like pushes us way, pa way past any sort of anything. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm just getting ready to make myself some dinner here, but I just had to share that because I'm just like blown away every freaking time. Um, it's going to be really boring and do the same thing I had yesterday, and I'm going to do a little Indian sauce, and yeah, but um, let me show you. So I showed you guys, I can't remember if I like filmed it, I think I filmed it while Donnie was here, but I didn't actually say anything. These are my new shoes. My only problem is, is I think they might be a little small. Do you guys have this problem? Do Nikes run a little small? I wear a nine and a half, so I ordered nine and a half because they said it was true to size, but I feel like they fit perfectly and I'm thinking they might need to be a little bit bigger. Gosh, they're so amazing. So I can't wait to wear those. And then I also got the swimsuit I ordered um, from Beach Babe Swimwear. First of all, I didn't realize it was like not black. It's like a charcoal. It's really freaking cute. Maybe charcoal is cute. But um, I think it might be a little, a little big because I don't have big boobs here. But look at the detailing. It's so cute. And then it does like a cross back um, and ties. It's just gorgeous. I love the way that these are made. But, and there's no place to put padding. I totally thought there was. Urgh. I might have to return this. We'll see though. Anyways, got those. Excited about my shoes. I'm gonna make my dinner and then um, work on some vlogs. And yeah, just really good workout. I'm feeling good. I posted a before and after picture on IG. And um, you guys are so just sweet. I'm often embarrassed because, to be honest with you, I I've never been bigger. Like I've always you know, been a dancer and I've always been really fit. And then when my mom passed away, that before picture is kind of a reflection of just where I was. Um, but you guys are so sweet. Uh, Simply Chrissy says, is it true that you are the same exact weight? I thought I heard you say that on a video. Yeah, I'm about, I'd say about 10 pounds uh, lighter than that now. Um, I think I weighed like 162 or something in that picture. And right now I weigh, I fluctuate anywhere from like 145 to 152 or something, 150. And I've just, I put on so much muscle that I think that's where it comes from. And then Alley Alley 6. Um, you guys are just so sweet. I just love reading your comments and stuff. And go ahead and ask me any questions that you have. I will be more than happy to answer them. Um, anyways, tonight's the first night of Hanukkah. So I'm going to wait for the hubby to get home, but I'm going to use, I think, this year, this menorah that I thrifted from Savers a while ago. I love it. It's just really, really cute. So I'm going to like that. And do you want to say hi, Sansa? Say hi, Sophie. And say hi, Sashi. Uh, Oscars. Oscars, do you want to say hi? And that's, that's him saying hi. Okay. All right. I'm going to make my dinner.
All right, it's time to light the menorah, even though it's past the time you're supposed to light the menorah. It's the thought that counts. Anyways, in case you guys have never uh, seen this before, I'm about to show you. Oh my, God, my arm is sore. Are we? Are we? Yeah, my calves. All right. All right. Do you guys like my decorations? Do you guys like my decorations? Get the matches. So you're supposed to light this candle first and then use this candle to light the other one. Light the center one first? Yeah. Do you want to say something? Okay, I can say it. Go ahead. And then grab that candle. Okay, you got it. Careful, it's leaking. Mm -hmm. Baruch Atah Adonai, Eloheinu Melech HaOlam, Asher Kedishanu, Femitzvosa Etzivanu, Ner Shel Hanukkah. Yay! Good job. And that, my friends, is the first night. Hey guys, so I just got home from work and I just really quickly changed. I'm actually heading over to the holiday party for our, um, for the A-team, for... Um, my coach, what the hell am I trying to say? <laughs> um, I really have to do something about this light. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just wearing, you probably remember this shirt I got at, um, Forever 21 a while back, and my American Eagle jeans, and I'm just gonna put on some booties, and I'm putting on some red lips, because it's a holiday party, and my hair is all scraggly, and there's Samson and Sophie, and I will film while I'm there. Um, they're going to do a demo for the surfing class, so I'll see if I can't film that because that'll be kind of cool for you guys to see. And then if you're ever in Las Vegas, you can come to the surfing extravaganza that they do. So, anyways, I will talk to you guys when I get back. Oh, and look at all my holiday cards. I bought this at uh, Marshall's a while back, and I've just been putting all my holiday cards on the wall here. All right. I'll see you later. So I didn't grill my chicken yet because we ran out of gas, but just wanted to show you guys what I'm taking with me to holiday parties. This is part of my, I'm doing a blog post, um, and it's part of my um, like three secrets to stay lean during the holidays. Um, when you're going to a holiday party, first of all, eat. Eat a meal, um, like two hours before, an hour before. And then also bring some things that you know that you can eat. So I brought some turkey breasts. I just measured, measured out four ounces of turkey breast and then um, some broccoli. And I know that... I can eat those, they're clean, and you know I might find other things at the party that I can eat, but at least then I know I have a good foundation of food with me, and that will save you from making bad choices or eating something you didn't want to eat, or overeating. So, part of my hints there. I'm gonna let the dogs out, and I'm ready to go. Hey guys, so I just wanted to get on here really quick um, because I had a little bit of time while I was driving, so this will be my chit chat you can't see me in the dark video. Um, so let's see, what did I wanna fill you in on? Um, I today signed up for the off season prep with Kimoto. Um, I technically did the competition prep even though I didn't actually compete. Um, I still followed through with it and, and kind of stayed on the program that he was giving me at the time. Um, but right now I'm doing an off-season prep and that essentially is going to carry me through until uh, March of next year, April, and then, well, March, I think March. Um, and it should align fairly nicely with um, 12 weeks out from the competition in May, which um, I've decided to do with Danya here in Las Vegas. And I'm excited, A, because um, I have Danya to do it with and we did our last one together and we had such a great time. And B, I'm going to be under the guidance of some pretty incredible coaches who, you know, are, are experts at competing. So, with those two aligned, and then obviously my mind hopefully not getting in the way of things, and um, life not getting in the way, I will be able to do it, and I will do it successfully. So, there's that, and I'm really excited about it. Um, I got my first kind of follow-up next Tuesday, so I will let you know how that goes. Let me know if you guys want to know how it's going. I might do like a off-season um, prep series or something just so that you guys can follow me along um, this off-season. And I'm curious to see how he will, you know, like what he'll do with my diet and um, cardio and things like that. I'm so far ahead that I'm excited because I'm hoping that that will 
mean that, you know, if I start now, um, I don't have to go as crazy when the time comes with my schedule and all the other things I'm doing. It's just something that, you know, I don't want to do. I don't want to be low energy all the time. And so I got a lot of things and great things coming with the blog. Um, I started blogging with um, the sweat store and I'm really excited about that. And I'm also going to, um, blogging for a local store called Apricot Lane and I have a video coming out me and my sister went to the grand opening and so I'm just need to edit that and that will be out um, and I'll, I'll show you guys but I'm gonna be having a local event at Apricot Lane I believe the date is gonna be January 14th so for anybody who's gonna be in Vegas or who lives here um, I really would love to meet all of you guys and um, there's they're doing great gifts like $100 gift bags for the first 25 that RSVP and just a lot of great things and I think it'll just be a fun opportunity for like a meet and greet and I'm gonna get Edwina to do it, Danya and Faith, so we'll all be there. Um, so there's that and then obviously uh, I have um, a big trip I'm taking next year. I haven't gone on vacation in a long time so I'm excited about that. So anyways just wanted to fill you guys in on that. I am still gonna be training with Stacey Alexander so um, you know I've just been doing that twice a week and really focusing on glutes and then um, Donnie and I are meeting every one week on Saturdays to kind of incorporate some plyos slash glutes um, so yeah it's kind of what my uh, split is looking like I'm doing Mondays I'm doing like shoulders rear delts and triceps and abs Tuesdays I'm doing legs so glutes hamstrings focus Wednesdays I'm doing back um, biceps and abs and then Thursdays are my rest day but I still do cardio and then Friday I am doing another booty uh, training and then Saturdays I'm doing plyos and then Sundays I'm doing uh, just cardio so it's kind of a rest day so that's kind of my five day split anyways I'm gonna stop talking so I don't waste the battery just wanted to check with you guys again I'm not really sure if you can see me but I'm on my way to the A team all right that's what you see bye Say hi! Do you guys remember this one? What up? It's Jen Hayes. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Happy Hanukkah. Kwanzaa. 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 <laughs> happy New Year. Happy New Year. You save it. You just say Happy New Year. And say hi, Carolina. Hi. Merry Christmas. These are my A Team girls. And then we got this Fulio. I just like food. I'm <laughs> <laughs> I was outside and brought me in here. He wasn't invited. Merry Christmas to Say all. Say hi to everybody. Merry Christmas and world. He, and you are? Um, the coolest kid in America. Oh boy. <laughs> hashtag Travis Porno. I'm, hashtag I'm going to make my you own. You have your own hashtag? Yeah, I'm on Oh, he's going to make his own YouTube, you guys. So you'll have to check him out. Yeah. He likes to post videos of himself doing and things. And like himself. Guilty. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Anyways, we're waiting for the surfboard demo so we can all learn how to do it. Surfboard like Beyonce? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, so that's that. I ate my food out of my baggie and I'm, I'm here. <laughs> Started just teaching classes at random locations till now, opening 18 and moving. So, you guys are what makes 18. So, just want to say thanks, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Now, her mom yeah. actually made this um, red velvet. velvet. Okay, wow. <laughs> we need to cut it before it's going to dry leaves. So, I have my tripod on my camera right now. Um, just got home from the party. What a fun time. You got to meet some of my people and um, Travis um, and a few other people that uh, I will be introducing to you guys very soon. Let me see if I can set this up. I'm going to see if I can cook my dinner while talking to you guys. Um, yeah, I think I can. Anyways, so I'm actually just making my dinner because I wasn't able to eat. I just brought that turkey and broccoli with me. So I am just um, 
I'm chopping up some asparagus that I had already made. Got about a third cup of brown rice, or half cup actually. And I'm gonna do some of this tiki tikka masala. Um, it's non-dairy, and it's kind of a, it's only got 90 calories and six grams of fat for a third cup. And I'm only gonna do like a couple tablespoons of it, um, just to add some flavors. Right now, I don't start my off-season prep until next week, so try to enjoy some different flavors right now until I start that. But anyways, about the party, it was a lot of fun. I had a really good time. The hubby um, looks like he grilled some chicken breast, which I was excited about. I'm going to do about four ounces of chicken breast, and then yeah, I'm going to get to eating. So anyways, I'll show you what this looks like. Um, okay, now you guys can't see me. Hold on. Just cut up this chicken here. I honestly like to just break it up and then throw it in and then I'm going to add a little bit of water. Um, and I just use my hands. Yep. Okay. That's that. I'm going to add some water and wash my hands. We'll be right back. So that's kind of what it looks like, and then I just add a little bit of water there, put the cover on, and it'll be ready. Hi guys! It is Thursday, and I just got home. I'm just making a quick little protein pancake. This time I used my first form protein. Almost out of that flavor, so um, ordering ice cream sandwich flavor. Um, the hubby requested that. And I'm just going to put about a tablespoon of my crunchy sprouts peanut butter. I can do that right now because I'm not quite on a plan yet, but um, yeah, I'm just going to kind of get my uh, protein pancake ready. Sorry, I'm like trying to mess with this um, while I get ready to go train. More than likely, I will be doing legs, which is fine by me. I'm going to train at the A-Team Training Center. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna put some of this peanut butter. It was in the fridge, so it's all like hard, but anyways, I'm gonna fold that over so it melts. I'm gonna eat that up. It's kind of my pre-workout. I made a cup of coffee. I'm gonna watch a few YouTube videos to get me motivated. And then I'm gonna head off to the gym. Let me show you what I'm wearing before I forget it. Um, Muscle Club Apparel, I get a discount on Muscle Club Apparel, you guys. I know I always mention it, but they have really cute tanks and stuff, and I also get them from the sweat store. Um, this one's the I Love to Train. I'm wearing my Piva leggings. I don't know if she still has some of these left. I think she does, and they're on sale. And I'm getting um, her new collection soon. It should be coming soon, so I'm really excited. Um, Try it on those Nikes. They're too small. So if you guys are planning on ordering these... Nike, I need to figure out how to exchange them. These Nike Zooms, they're amazing. They're so cute. They're so comfortable, but they're like a half size too small. I wear nine and a half. I should have ordered 10. So that's that. Anyways, I'm gonna eat my food and then go to the gym. Workout, but I did film some of it. That was brutal. I swear, every time I do glutes with Stacy, she like 
pushes me beyond um, where I normally would go anytime. It's like my butt is on fire. I guess that's the whole point, right? Anyways, I'm like trying to do this one one hand that's not working. Um, just got home and I'm just making kind of my normal. I'm sauteing some onions, a um, little spray of olive oil, and then I'm going to be using um, this Calfrezi, I think it's pronounced. Medium hot curry sauce. Um, again, non-dairy, organic. It's got 90 calories and 5 grams of fat. And about nine grams of carbs. It's um, it's not bad. I mean, I don't use a lot of it. Like I said, I only use like a tablespoon, and I think the serving size is a third cup. So I do that. I'm gonna do some Brussels sprouts that I chopped up here, and then the chicken that I've already prepared that's already been uh, grilled that my hubby did, and I'm just gonna do about four ounces of that. Um, so, anyways, I used this um, scale. Some of you guys were asking me. I got it on Groupon a while ago by Escali. It's a really good scale. I do need a new battery for it though. A lot of good that does me. Anyways, I'm going to get to grilling this and then I'm going to eat dinner. This one smells really good.